pay attention because... All right, Lyle, what are we doing today? Hey, it's a great weekend at Estevan. It's the uh, Estevan United Way Telethon. Exactly. Two so days, two days, 335,000 bucks, 15 member agencies are going to benefit. It's great. The community comes together. It's outstanding for the entire southeast corner of the province. Let's get her done. Education. Zero. Zero. Travis, did you go and give away more money? 20 bucks. $720. The 36 hour event saw a ton of money raised along with some amazing acts from some of the young kids in school to some of the young at heart. And it was an amazing atmosphere everywhere you looked. High fives, high fives. Good job, guys. Good job. Yeah. Whoops. Close. One more, yeah. There's lots of people that are happy. Now, not only on the radio station were we keeping you updated on both the total and the entertainment on the stage, we were also talking with some of the people involved with the telethon, those who have made some major contributions towards their community, and those who've been affected by this amazing, amazing fundraiser as well. Yeah, so uh, this year we were able to raise $44,000. Uh, for the telethon, and uh, over the course of the 10 years, our total is it's about 320,000 now. My goodness, that is just amazing. You know what? That's that's exactly what it takes to make this uh, make this fly each and every year, Justin. So you know, congratulations to Tamil, you and the entire crew, and everybody else that seems so dedicated to make this happen, to uh, make the quality of life better for a lot of people right here in Southeast Saskatchewan. So. <laughs> She's here to be talking about a little bit on what the breakfast program does in the school and give us a little bit about how the Funds from United Way goes to support these students. So, Sarah. Uh, so we have a breakfast program that we run out of the Hillcrest Breakfast Room every morning and that supports any student who would like to come and attend and uh, we've been doing that for this is our eighth year and we uh, receive funds from the United Way every year in order for us to purchase groceries and to make sure that our program runs really smoothly. After that, the radio station took a little bit of a break, but the folks at the United Way went through the night all night long, and we returned in the morning to get back on the radio. Now, not only were we on the radio, but we also had a chance to have some fun on the TV broadcasts as hosts, and we even got involved in some of the activities, and it got a little weird. Now, whether you're one of the amazing people who came out and performed during the telethon, one of the people who made a donation towards the raffle table, and of course, one of the people who decided to make a donation towards the United Way telethon, we here thank you and congratulate the Esteban United Way for once again hitting their goal. Let's turn things over to United Way President Travis Frank for the final word. I just want to say thank you once again to our community. Uh, United Way, I've said this a couple of times throughout the year, our tagline as United Way Canada is give, volunteer, act. And earlier this year I got to be a part of the Day of Caring where we volunteered and today I got to be a part of, of the telethon where we gave. And uh, boy did we give. So that's all I'm going to say and we're going to turn around these numbers. Remember I kind of said our, I've been up in our goal every couple of minutes. And uh, I said I'd want to hit the 370, so let's see if we do it. We'll start right. over there with uh, Sheila. Zero. Nine. Two. Two. two seven, seven. Three. <laughs> David, is that a record? By how many dollars? As tradition. Selfie. Selfie with a bald guy. Everybody zip in there nice and close. Pretend you still like each other after 33 hours and nobody smells. Three, two, one. 